Okay, so I've just come through the mayoring squirt, which is at the end of the Karoo. And uh, yeah, the, the Karoo is kind of a, a strange um, enigma in the sense. It's basically a, a desert that kind of pretends to be a... Um, well, it, you know, it, it was, it used to be the bottom of the ocean. Um, at one point it was the bottom of the sea, then, then the bottom of a lake, and then eventually a swamp, and then eventually desert. And, um, yeah, it's pretty amazing that something that, that, that looks like desert, which I guess today is desert, was once covered in water. And, yeah, it's strange driving through the Karoo on a day like today, and, um, seeing it so wet, seeing mist everywhere, you know, seeing, you know, usually it's just endless blue sky and endless sun and, 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 and it's very hot and, and today it was cool and dewy and wet and misty. It's just very rare that, that one actually sees that. So, um, I also noticed a lot of crows and, and ravens and it just made me think, you know, these are creatures that live off the mistakes of the dead and um, now I kind of had a, a strange thought is, is that what we do as, as writers is that what we do as journalists is that is that what all people do is that what all living things do we, we live off the dead um, you know and and the human race are we living off the mistakes of, of the dead the, you know the people that came before us you know is, is, is it all living off the mistakes of the dead so I thought that was just an interesting thought um, so I'm just, I'm, I'm about to enter a place called Oatswin and then I'm going over a big mountain pass and then I'll be at the sea, so looking forward to that. Um, I did have another thought, uh, and, and that was, with regard to, so it was crows, of the dead. Yes, I can't actually remember, I'm so tired.